So we put one gallon of liquid chlorine into the pool yesterday, and now I'm going to test it in uh, two or three different ways here to verify how much of that chlorine held the next day. Using a 10 milliliter sample. And then you get your 0871. Pink to clear at eight. So since we were doing the 10 milliliter sample, then each uh, drop is 0.5 parts per million. So with eight drops, that means we've got four parts per million, which is right in the target for what I wanted for this pool. And that's really based off that gallon of chlorine we put in the pool yesterday. There's not a lot of algae or debris in the pool, so it hasn't a lot of it hasn't been consumed overnight. All right, so good on the chlorine test. I'm gonna ahead and do another chlorine test this time with the old school reagent. This is an old one I've had for a long time, but the five drops of the OTO. I don't even know how valid this stuff is because it's pretty old, like I said. But we'll see if it gets a, a high reading like my Taylor test kit did. So five drops. Yeah, it looks pretty dark already. Yeah, so you can see that that something light behind it this this is pretty high it's showing at least four four or five then that that ties out with my um, test I did with the uh, the dippers here with the Taylor test kit earlier which read four so then one uh, one other test I'll do today to just confirm is we'll go ahead and uh, look at another test strip see what the test strip comes up with so here's today's test strip, and uh, yeah, you can definitely see that chlorine level for uh, free chlorine. It's definitely um, definitely at least three, not quite five, so I think four was the reading we were getting. It looks pretty good. And then uh, total, total chlorine, same thing. It's between the, the three and the five here. And then uh, alkalinity. Again, we're showing about 80, which I confirmed yesterday. And then uh, pH is showing a little bit high, seven, probably about eight. It's probably it's probably about eight, seven, eight to eight. It's always running high in this pool. And then, uh, yeah, this total hardness is always it's always at 450. We got well water and a lot of calcium and hardness in the water. It's always about 450. So that, again, ties out with uh, this test and with the other tests. So.